Tonight, we're learning about a selfless act of heroism during the senseless shooting. A father says he owes a debt of gratitude to a homeless man who shielded his daughter and her friends from the gunfire. CBS 13's Steve Large is live downtown and spoke with that hero tonight in an interview you'll see only on CBS 13. Steve. Well, this hero's home on the night of the mass shooting was this street, the K Street Mall, and this is his space where he stays on K Street. And this is where he shielded these young ladies as the gunfire was flying everywhere. They were panic stricken. They were falling over each other to try to get try to get shelter. Tim Langer describes the moment he helped four women escape the mass shooting in Sacramento. All right, get down. Anna. These are the sounds of K Street as it turned into a war zone, the women running for cover. From what I could see, the state of poor, I was just trying to calm them down and keep them reassured that everything was going to be all right. Langer is homeless and lives on K Street. He was asleep in this alcove when the gunfire started and he helped shepherd the women to safety. He literally stood out and got to protect them from anybody that came. Tom Orozco is the father of one of the women. He credits Langer for protecting his daughter at all costs. He was willing to, to put himself in the line of fire. I had no doubt. It is a moment of terror that has left this father feeling forever indebted. Because I just know there's good people everywhere. To a man who proves a home is no measure of someone's heart. You know, we're given opportunities every second that we're alive. Well, this father says that he plans on staying connected with Tim. In fact, he hopes to help him with anything he can to get him out of homeless now. Homelessness. Yeah, I got to repeat that line. A home is no measure of a person's heart. Wow, powerful words. Steve, thank you. What a story.